We'll do it at 6 o'clock. Hurricane season will be here before we know it. But is there anything the CBS 17 storm team is watching just yet? Meteorologist Rachel Dunsing is here with a look at that. Rachel. Yeah, so we are now five days out from the official start of hurricane season June 1st, but there's something moving across the Atlantic right now that we're going to keep an eye on. But don't worry, it's not a developing tropical system. It's dust. Saharan dust or the Saharan air layer is exactly what it sounds like. Dry, dusty air that comes off the Saharan desert and moves from the east to the west across the Atlantic Ocean, eventually into the Caribbean and sometimes even into the Gulf. Now, the Saharan dust normally sits about a mile up in the sky and it can be up to two to two and a half miles thick. This is really important when we're tra tracking tropical systems because that dry layer can limit tropical development. Now remember, tropical storms and hurricanes need warm, moist air that stretches high in the sky. So if there isn't as much of that moisture there, thanks to the dust, it's a lot harder for those storms to form. Saharan dust normally peaks in the middle of June, but we can get it anytime from late spring through early fall. Now, at the beginning of hurricane season, which again we're getting very close to, we keep an eye on a few main development zones. The Western Gulf, as well as the Western Caribbean, as well as the Bahamas, and also into the far Western Atlantic, right off of our coast. Now, all of this to say, these are the areas that we are watching, but we are not expecting any tropical development within the next week, which is, of course, great news.